I'm Jerry James Stone, and I'm here to talk to you today about food waste. Food waste is a serious issue in this country. The reason I'm doing this is because I've partnered up with Bayrock, this coalition in the San Francisco Bay Area, which is focusing on fighting food waste, something I care a lot about. The reason is we waste so much food here in America, so much food, 40%. From farm to fork, we waste 40%. And while you think it might be restaurants that are wasting the food, the biggest culprit in that kind of waste is people like you and me. But it's actually easy to change. Small changes can make a huge impact, which is why I'm going to show you how to take these lemons and get three separate recipes out of them. Three. One fruit, three recipes. We're gonna make this amazing lemonade with cilantro and jalapenos. It's spicy, it's tart, it's sweet. It's the perfect thing to drink. We're gonna make lemon pepper using the zest from these lemons. And then the leftover rinds, I'm gonna take them and turn them into a household cleaner. How great is that? So instead of putting this stuff directly in the trash, you can get so much out of a single ingredient. Here's just one other way to think about it. Here in California, we're the top producer for many of the nation's fruits, nuts, and vegetables. So when you waste our food, you waste our water. And we're in a pretty severe drought, so we really don't want that. Getting the most out of this stuff is the best thing you can do. So let's get to it, shall we? So when you're making uh, lemonade, you obviously end up with all these peels left over, which usually are just discarded, but you don't have to do that. You actually can uh, zest them first, which is what we're gonna do. And we're gonna make a delicious uh, lemon pepper with the zest before we make the actual lemonade itself. So just go ahead and shave off the... Lemon zest makes the kitchen smell so good. So now we're gonna add in our whole peppercorns. And now that we've dried out our lemon peel, we just have to grind up the spice. And then salt. Just mix it all together. There we go. Okay, so now we've made our lemon pepper. Now let's make the lemonade. So uh, for this lemonade, we're gonna create a simple syrup made with, infused with cilantro and jalapeno. We're doing this for a couple reasons, because cilantro and jalapeno are amazing and tasty, but also because a simple syrup is much easier to uh, make lemonade with than just adding in sugar. It'll dissolve a lot faster. As the sugar starts to dissolve, we'll then add in our jalapenos and our chopped cilantro. Now that we've uh, zested our lemons, we're gonna go ahead and juice them to make lemonade. So to make our lemonade, we're add in our lemon juice, our squeezed lemon juice. Add in our cilantro jalapeno simple syrup. And add in some water. And enjoy. Okay, so we've made our two recipes. We made our lemon pepper, we made our lemonade. Now I'm gonna show you how to make this wonderful household cleaner. So to make this uh, cleaner, just go ahead and add in our lemon peels to a mason jar along with some fresh thyme, we'll layer them in there. And then we're just going to fill the mason jar up with just regular old white vinegar. <laughs> Let this steep for a couple weeks. So this vinegar is pretty much all purpose. Although I wouldn't use it on marble because vinegar is acidic, so it actually could mar the finish. Another thing when you're using this, if you wanna use it as a disinfectant, you can use it just completely undiluted. But to use it as a cleaner, I would use one part of the vinegar solution with four parts water and a couple tablespoons of borax. And there you have it, amazing lemon thyme, natural homemade cleaner. And you fought food waste the whole way. So there you have it. Three separate recipes, one single ingredient, and less food waste. That's what we're here for. If you want more information, be sure to check out lovefoodnotwaste.org for lots of resources on recipes, tips, and how you yourself can fight food waste. This video has been brought to you by Bayrock, the Bay Area Recycling Outreach Coalition.